Welcome back to Silent Hill. We just got the key of Haggith, and I think this is the door that it goes to. Yep. Jesus, those noises. <laughs> uh, what floor am I on now? One? I guess I am. Alright, let's try two. Freaking jackhammer noise. Let me see if I can do this without shooting. Oh. Oh. Ugh, I hate it when they arrive. I didn't realize it was so easy to take him out without a gun. Could have saved a bit of shotgun ammo. Which I desperately need. I've only got two shotgun shots left, I think. And 15 pistol rounds also, I think. Crest of Mercury. Looks very similar to the Solomon thing. Yeah, the Amulet of Solomon, Crest of Mercury. What's all this stuff going to be used for? I'm glad that doesn't open. Ring of Contract? Rustic, hefty-looking ring of unknown material. Snake and the symbol of Mercury signifies alchemy. Why do I feel like I'm gathering all the things to summon the demon or something? Am I being used as a pawn by the demon? Okay, this is new. This again, this is the same thing that was through the hole in the wall in the antique shop. Looks like an altar, I wonder what they worship. The light to the future. The light illuminating the darkness. Well, there's two doors, and there's one painting on each side, probably related to the password. How could they relate, though? Just a bunch of buttons to press. How would that relate to this? Huh. 
Huh. I'm hoping I just don't have everything I need to do that yet. Wait, but then again, if I don't, then... Where do I go? What do I do with the stuff that I currently have? I've gained a crest of mercury and a ring, but none of that's going to help me get through any more doors, right? Pretty sure I'm missing a piece of the puzzle to solve those two doors with the two paintings. So I'm just wandering around and I think I found an area that I haven't explored before. I wish I could tell you where it is because, well, I don't have a map. I think it's on the second floor. I killed a couple nurses with my melee weapon and I just unlocked this door from this side, which takes me to the main hallway with all the doors that are that are locked with like Hagglyph and all those different keys that I need. Which means I must not have explored this, I think, unless I just missed that one door and these nurses happened to have spawned after I left. Oh no, this is definitely new. I don't know how I missed this place. I don't even know how I got to it. What's that? Camera? Hmm. That might be related to the door puzzle. Yeah, because it had to do with light. Maybe the flash of the camera or something will reveal something in the photos. This is the room with the plate, isn't it? Yes, I can finally use my screwdriver. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. There is a key. It's electrified, isn't it? Electricity is flowing to the key. I'll get shocked if I grab it now. Hmm. I probably have to turn off the power rather than, like, do something to get it, because I don't have any gloves. I don't think taking a picture of it would work. Nah, we gotta come back here. I think I need to use a camera on the pictures. Let's go try that. Yeah, it specifies camera with flash. Aha! The light to the future. Let me take a picture of this. Let's do this one first. Okay, I think this is gonna do it. I think everything that's in white in the picture is probably the things that need to stay as they are, and I need to switch the other ones to dark. So I think this will do it? No. Maybe it is the other way then. Yeah, you have to darken the ones that are light in the picture. Strange. Cage key. I know where to use that, although I'm not entirely sure how to get there. There's a botanical reference book. Don't need to read it now. This is that. But this is the director's office, isn't it? The one where, when I came to it, it was all uh, ransacked and someone had smashed that vial of that drug.
Wait, is that it? Is this not a thing here? Stands out so much, but I can't interact with it. I guess it was just a health drink, just a bonus. Wait, what's that? Oh, just more books. Okay, to the birdcage. Oh god. No, 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 no. No, no, no. This is the bad room. I forgot about you. Oh, Jesus Christ. Please tell me this is the room? Yeah. Key of Phallig. Take it. Yes. Okay, that's one of the doors out here in this hallway. Is it this one? Yeah. Slow CD imagery detected it, the emulator just said. It's fine. That's not fine, though, whatever I'm hearing. Whoa, what? Oh my god, they're invisible! What the fuck? Sort of invisible, I can see a tiny outline. Like the sort of outline and transparency those baby things have? How am I doing on health, by the way? Oh, I'm orange, actually. I've got 30 shots of pistol ammo. And I think I've got some rifle ammo. Two shotgun shots, six rifle shots. Yeah, not great, but not bad. Bethor. Oh god, there's more. It's like I'm passing through a series of trials. Oh yeah, the kitchen. <laughs> That's new. The hell is that stuck in it? I'll check that in a second. Is that a sword? The chain is missing a link. There's a dagger of Melchior. Sure, I'll take it. You hear that sound? Not the obvious horrible sound, but like the sound of something scurrying within. What the hell's in there? So I need something to join the links together. Ancient dagger named after the Magi. Magi, however you want to say that word. Okay, so I can't equip it. I can't use it as a weapon. Oh god! Oh, am I- Oh, wow! So, I think removing the sword pisses it off. I probably need to put something to secure the link so that if- when it tries to come out, it can't. Okay, this time, let's just not go in here, huh? Actually, hold on, is there something here? No. Nope. Goodbye. Don't piss off the tentacles. God, the boxes just look like they're soaked with blood. Like people just put a bunch of chunky body parts in them. Jelly beans. 
Do you want to open the bag? <laughs> I'm scared. Are tentacles going to come out of it? Wow, Harry, nice. Good job. Oh, Key of Bethor. Why was that in there? That's weird. I mean, I know it's Silent Hill, like, everything's weird, but... Oh no. Can I play the tape again? Is there something else on it now? It's old but usable. Great. Okay. What is it? Still has an unusually high fever. Eyes don't open. Getting a pulse, but just barely breathing. Her skin is all charred. Even when I change the bandages, the blood and pus just start oozing through. Why? What is keeping that child alive? I can't stand it any longer. I won't tell a soul. I promise. So please. Okay, interesting. So that's a completely un unmessed up, unstaticky version of the tape that we saw before. Is it broken again? No, you can watch it as many times as you want. Okay. Yeah, so I thought, I was pretty damn sure that they said, like, his skin is on fire, but no, they say her. And what is keeping this child alive? Blood and pus just seep through any bandages they put on. I won't tell a soul, I promise. It sounds like they're... I won't tell a soul, I promise. It sounds like someone's going to euthanize them. I'm gonna kill them, just... Put them out of their misery. And that's what they're talking about. I won't tell a soul. Like, I won't tell a soul if you if you do this. What is the child, though? God, I hope it's not Cheryl. Alessa? I don't know. Is the child being kept alive through dark arts? Because their body or soul or something is still being used by the demon? I don't know, but it seems like Alessa was the, the form that the demon was taking. Not Cheryl. But then it could also, the tape could have been talking about Alessa as well. It's a pretty cozy room. Sort of. Someone who collected butterflies. There's specimens of butterflies and moths hanging on the wall. Oh, the safe point was just called ch Childs? Childs. The child's drawings are scattered on the floor. That uniform on the wall there, I think this is Alessa's room. Girl's clothing hangs on the wall. Six, maybe seven. Must be a kid about that age. None of this stuff is of any use. Old fairy tales, picture books of animals, plants on the shelf. Cards are scattered on the floor. There are dolls on the floor. Can we get a look at those? Uh, not really. I can see one of the heads. Thou possess... Thou, thou possess them to guard thy spirit. Evoke five rites. Unveil thy fate. Ah, so this is where the Star of Solomon goes, and the Mercury thing, and the sword. 
Okay. Alright, we got the key of Bethor or something. Hmm. I don't think I'm going to get out of this room. Not easily. Floors and walls are covered with graffiti. Onk. Wow, it let me leave. I thought that was a highly cursed room. Key of Bethor. There we go. Ugh. Generator room. Oh. I can turn off the power here and then that will allow me to get that key. Right? Do you want to press the switch? <laughs> I'm going to turn off the power. Wait. If I turn off the power, that means the elevator isn't going to work, right? Do I have any way to get to that key? Am I on the right level right now? I don't remember. Hmm. Yeah, where am I? Check the elevator won't work. Yeah. I think this is the right place. I think. Um. If so, then I think it's here. Nope. Oh, this is the birdcage. Well, then I know what the opposite door is. I am totally lost. Okay, I think it's this one. Just went through a couple doors and then I started recognizing something. Yeah, it's this one. So what is this a key to? Key of Aratron. Have I seen a door that takes that? That doesn't spark any memories. Aratron. Oh, is it this one here? Yeah, I think I just totally missed this door before. Why is this taking so long? That's always a bad sign. Everything is going according to plan, sheltered in the womb. But it's not done yet. Half the soul is lost. That is why the seed lies dormant. And what soul remains captured in that husk? is buried deep down in the subconscious. Are you trying to say it won't work? That wasn't our agreement. No, no, these are just stalling tactics. If we lend a hand, we will be able to get power. Never fear, the promise shall not be broken. But the power we could draw now will be very weak. Almost nothing. Unless we get the other half of the soul. We'll use a magical spell. Feeling this child's pain, it's sure to come. But that will take time. So what I gathered from that, I'm pretty certain they're talking about Alessa. I don't know how Cheryl got mixed up in all this. But, uh... Yeah, so it sounds like they 
had chosen Alessa as a bearer of the the demon seed or something, gonna sprout out of them ever since they were in the womb, I think. And then I guess maybe an accident happened and that left them nearly dead. And that's why they're talking about like the plan is has gone awry. It won't be powerful enough. It's not going to work because not all of the soul is there. Some of it is uh, here, I guess, or something. So I wonder if Cheryl's involved in their plans, some sort of backup plan to use someone else or something. I have no idea. But yeah, one of the people there around the table was that asshole business person who we met at Anne's bar and went into their hotel room and they took the drugs away from us. Oh yeah, we've been to this room before. We saw this picture and this bed. Disc of Ouroboros. So that's it, huh? I still feel like I'm missing something, though. Because I still don't have the sword, nor do I have something to tie that chain up to be able to get the sword, right? Use the disc of Ouroboros. Just gonna go ahead and put everything in here but the sword, just see if anything happens. Onk. Crest of Mercury. Amulet of Solomon. Oh, wait a minute. Actually, I think I do have what I need to join the link. I think maybe that ring of contract will work. Let's see. Uh, can I do this without taking the sword? The chain is missing a link. Oh, oh, take it. No, no, don't. Yes. All right. Run! Can't get out. Can't get out. Go on, Harry, go. That's a strong ring. I'm gonna stop here. God, what a horrible racket, huh? So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we're gonna pass through the not very nice looking door.